Hey there, this is Matteo from Spartaco Milano and today we're in Via de Fontarini in the Morivione neighborhood pretty close to the Bocconi University in order to show you a shared apartment with three bedrooms and two bathrooms which is located on the second floor is accessible only through the stairs. So we'll just start showing you the beautiful court of this building and now let's just go ahead and I'll show you around. So as we enter we have on our right the bathroom. While proceeding we find ourselves in the living room and kitchen and over here we find the spiral stairs that are leading to the higher floor where the three bedrooms are. So we quickly begin with a panoramic of the living room where we find a round table with four seats, two comfortable couches on this corner and we have two luminous windows that are overlooking Via de Fontanelli indeed. So in this direction we have a couple of buses passing by one on the opposite one we're gonna find the Bocconi University walking distance. Now as for the kitchen, we find this bench table with two seats, a microwave with a single sink, cupboard on top of it with all the plates and glasses, a gas stove and the oven at the bottom. While on this corner we find the freezer on top with some storage space and the fridge at the bottom. This TV here will be placed on top of the chest of drawers. And now we'll just proceed showing you the first of the two bathrooms. Where we find the bathtub, a shower, a sink with a mirror on top of it, the toilets, bathroom bidet, and the washing machine. For which we have some racks for drying your clothes. You can already notice the pretty classic style of this building. A lot of wood around. So now let's just proceed with the higher floor, which is the third one, indeed. Here we find bedroom number one, two, three, and the second bathroom. In this case, we find a box shower. The toilets, both water and bidet, and the sink with a mirror on top. So as you can notice we're in the attic of the building. So for this floor we only have skylights, actually plenty of them, giving a lot of natural light to the environment. In this shared corridor we find a wardrobe and a chest of drawers. While through this pocket door we access bedroom number one which is the largest of them all. We like the shape of this room. We find three skylights, a large double bed right in the middle. They can be repositioned. So all over the walls here, we find plenty of storage space. They can be used as a wardrobe. In addition, we find a bedside table and a few servings. So the left side faces the street. While this one is just overlooking the courtyard of the building that we saw before. Now I'm just heading back and we're going to show you bedroom number two. Which is a bit smaller. In this case we find a standalone wardrobe. A large desk with an armchair. A single bed. Chest of drawers and a few shelvings with its own skylight on top of it. We have some more shelvings over here. While well, now just around the corner we find bedroom number three. Similar size as the previous one with a large desk with armchair, a single bed with bedside table, and a standalone wardrobe. In this case again, we have the skylight, which is overlooking the courtyard. So very nice apartment, classic style, lots of wood around, if you like it. And we have a pretty spacious common area. 
So with this, we should do everything. So thanks for watching and see you next time. Ciao, ciao.